Welcome back to the channel. Today's daily challenge is taco cart smash a taco cart. Now with that, we are going to do some other things. We are going to finish out the collectibles, reach new heights, and we are also going to do horizon open. So let me get over to this window. There we go. Um, I'm in the Dunas Blancas region. You're going to be looking for these lanterns. I only have a couple more that I need to smash. I've smashed a good many. Let's see if I can find some. There's a bunch there floating, but you kind of have to hit a jump to catch those. The other ones are like sitting on the, the tops. You can see them there on the ground. Some of the ones I already hit. I only need two more, and I was like, sure I was going to get them right off the bat. Okay. So, since I don't see any right now, there's some. Okay. There we go. There's one. There's some more. Okay. So, you really just need to have something big enough that you can hit them with, uh, i.e., a truck, a semi, whatever. There's the last one. So,. That's going to take care of that for us. That gives us, I think, three points. So the Horizon Open, even though it takes probably longer, is going to give us just two points. But we got to get the taco cart right now. So for that, I'm going to jump into the map. And like I told you guys yesterday, you can go to any town. They should have a taco cart. Uh, I'm going to try to fast travel to something here. A lot of stuff in there you can't fast travel to. It'll just bring up the leaderboard for all the trailblazers, speed traps, things like that. All right, so now we have to find... I am in the wrong view. Sorry about that. Now we got to find a taco truck. Taco cart. So is this it right here? Like right off the bat? <laughs> um, it didn't give me credit, at least. I'm not used to this. I was driving my GMC Jimmy for most of those lanterns. So then I jump into this. There it is. All right, so now we've got kind of the, the BS challenges out of the way. We did all the daily challenges and we got the collectible. So now we need to jump into Horizon Open Horizon. So I need to pick a Ford, guys. So. There's a Ford. I could do that one. I may do that one. I don't know what two is. Two would be sort. But I think we're just going to go. I could use that. I got to get there now. We're just going to use the Ford Puma, Forza Edition, it's pretty good. I used to use it all the time in Horizon Open Racing, except at this level, a lot of times you're going to get Lamborghinis and stuff like that, and it just can't compete. The suspension geometry, the, I don't really even know, it's not really tires, because you can't get a crazy tire. I guess you could if you have a Lamborghini, if you have a V10, you know, all-wheel drive, all that stuff, you hit it with a good tire. And then nothing else. Look at that. That thing is thick. That would be a uh, nice daily. I think I need to up my car game. The bad thing about those. They're just so expensive. I don't have. I don't have that kind of money to play with. It's a waste. It really is. If you have it. Yeah it's nice but. You can't afford to throw it away. Not cool, bro. Alright, so we do have another Forza Edition Ford Puma. We have a Hoonigan Kazi. Which wouldn't work for this. Weird. Alright, here we go. Massive launch. Remember I said this is a sprint, not a lap race, so that's good for us. Oh yeah, I gotta get into the zone here. There we go let off it's horizon open so I don't want to get wall collisioned which I did as you can hear now that now it's coming back on a little turbo action turbo noises 
because we are not behind the car with our camera anymore. We are inside, so we hear a lot of engine noise. Oh, this thing drives kind of weird with the steering wheel. Really twitchy. That Ferrari, man, it just ate it up. Oof. That's going to be... It's going to be a pit stop for us. All right, here we go. <laughs> I hate I hate this. I really do. I wish I could figure out why it does that. I think I have some ideas. Partly is when I think I'm turning back the other way, I'm not actually turning. I'm still turning left. Even though I'm taking the wheel, unless you're unless you're past center, you're still left. So, it's wild. And I think there's a difference between what you need to be able to race competitively in this, which is basically just like a, you know, a race setup F1 where you don't do multiple turns lock to lock, which I like because I really have this just because I want to cruise in like Hondas and regular cars, you know what I mean? I want to have a street car simulator, not not a race car. Why it always wants to spin out, I don't know. I think it's what I said, you're still turning left. Even though you try to turn back to the right, I don't know. But anyway, after this, we're going to go to a loading screen and all that. Then I'm going to go to the next race, but I'm going to quit because we've already gotten our challenge done, I believe. As long as we race one race. All right, so now we're going to get out of here. We'll get those two points. We'll get the car. We'll talk about tomorrow. And we'll go from there. There it is. We've got our notifications and everything. So we got the Ford Dually from Hot Wheels. And we're 46 in to get the MG6 X Power. Um, we've gotten everything we need to get done this week because we got 40 points. The only thing I left on the table, as always, as usual, are the seasonal championships. You can do them if you want. I'm just not thrilled to have them right now. Tomorrow we're going to start off. We have uh, the number 20 MG, MG6 race car, which actually it's kind of cool. Whatever. Um, already have a Ranger Raptor, so that's whatever. We will get it, but I don't really care. The weekly challenge first video is going to start off with the Cosworth. Um, a lot of people knew it, but I think it was made recently popular repopularized by Mr. Ken Block himself. Uh, so we're going to get into that. This is not the Hoonigan Cosworth. This is just the Ford one that is in the game. Then we'll have the daily. We'll get into the shop. Mini games making a comeback. The trial. It looks like we're going to be racing some utes maybe. You win a truck. Maybe you race a truck on dirt. I don't know. It's probably just Ford and some kind of class restriction, but we'll see. Playground games, team flag rush. Ugh. Uh, three PR stunts, which is nice. A photo challenge. Another PR stunt. Rounding out the three videos. Make sure you come back tomorrow to catch all those videos and stay up to date on the festival playlist. That way we can get this stuff done and we're not, you know, at the end of the week next Wednesday trying to get all this stuff in so we can get the rewards before it moves to the next one. I'll be here. I hope you guys are too. I'll see you then. Later. <laughs>